Hey guys, welcome back to my channel and hello again Aries. Alrighty guys, this will be our second career and money reading for January 2022, breaking down the weeks into quarters if you will. So this will be the outlook from, shall we say, quarter two or from the second week onwards. Hopefully you guys are all doing great. Let me now shuffle and let's begin our 10 card spread. We're always looking at ways to break down elements of a question and the question is related to your goal what why how and when where and with whom okay so 10 cards give us some ideas and we try to spark something productive something that could leave you with a next step you can control and we're looking always at how do i make more money how do i get a promotion how do i succeed at the business that i do so aries this is our first spread guys and we're going to do a second layer uh, just after but let's first observe and see what we have here so judging by looking at a possibility here looking at the five of coins okay material changes are on our mind okay material changes could relate to of course of course money that we make more of right uh, but could also relate to equipment it could also relate to the environment it could also relate to tools that you get it could relate to a location so let's try to figure out now what are we doing about material changes and you have decisions to make i love it so let's begin now ten of swords as our um, entry into the spread okay a thought that is rational a thought that needs to be completed okay a plan that needs to be completed and we have finances also involved in this plan if you will okay are you in frame yes you are goody and then we have a nine of cups so it's as if there is a feeling okay here's the feeling there's a feeling for you guys and with you guys that you want to finalize a particular shall we say part of a plan uh, understand a particular how to do something better in a plan see it's not a 10 so there's something missing here and that's something missing is something that I think can make a world of a difference for you. Understanding your next steps, understanding the priorities, or even if it is about validation. Okay? So, you as the department leader, you as the team leader, you're looking to complete a missing link. You have a decision that you want to get to. Okay? And I'm not going to look at the devil and say you're about to fire somebody. But really, there's the devil's energy there. Um, the term fire, well, uh, let go of, release, release of behaviors, routines, activities, sometimes team members that are not active. Okay, so that's an action on your mind. It's as if also it could have been more about waste. I see the devil and I see waste okay a wasted energy a wasted time a wasted effort and maybe also as a team leader you are looking for a sharper process for your team so they don't spend their time on the wrong leads at the wrong markets etc etc but seriously something that you see within your control okay very very um what's the word soft in terms of can you defeat that absolutely this is an everyday kind of exercise of willpower will we be complacent yes or no now the complacency part here and the and the ask for taking action is back to you finishing this plan off okay you adjusting the plan to a way that makes sense so you have a important decision here as an immediate result with a two of swords sharp it could take us one direction or another okay uh, so that's something that you're weighing on your mind and i love how you are weighing it on your mind your energies are very very mature guys you are looking like in this star moment here rechecking again what is the definition of the devil in your business in your market in the thing that you do okay understanding how i'm going to commit okay to make a plan that is lasting for the year to make a plan that shows improvements from last year, right? So I love the fact that you're involving your rationality along with also a little bit of seclusion. You're not trying to get influences around you. Alrighty, good, good, good. The asset available to you is how sharp and critical you are about this plan situation and how you are actually going to put it together in a way that makes sense so that you can run with opportunities. The doorway for opportunities comes with those priorities being set. And here we have a six of wands. It's as if an element of waste you're going to discover. You're spending extra maybe on some services on, I don't know, packaging, on 
things that can be dealt away with or done away with and then you're going to invest even more and more better now here about big action okay you're expected and you're being asked to analyze further analyze further in terms of the money or the material changes you are about to make now you may be considering a move to a new market altogether now we don't see numbers here that say this is the you know what uh, fool's card or this is the chariot this is the mobility there's someone moving but really material changes can take us there so a queen of coins is going to analyze is going to understand the proper next steps relying on uh, experience obviously but also relying on a long-term vision our purpose here was to be saturated and satisfied that we have adjusted our plan to make more money in 2022 this is the king of cups obviously they provide the missing link here to our nine of cups if you will so additional knowledge you're getting um, and I would not put it past you if you are consulting already with a source of information, a source of wisdom as well to help with that situation. The possibility, well, you're determined you're going to make some of these changes. Now, to what extent do we have a movement? To what extent does that change, you know what, affect you? Let's see in the second layer. And now there's something that, um, you know what, this deck here has been calling for me, the ancient Italian tarot. So... You know what over the past couple of weeks i think i have not read once with it so it's been kind of staring me marwan you haven't read with me let's read with the ancient italian tarot our uh, second layer here okay let's also see if there are any synchronicities as to you know what the task at hand what needs to happen in order for you to you know become that ace i see here additional information needed about money about cost savings etc etc okay guys let's see and here we are two four five six ah uh, check it out ah uh, check it out check it out okay and here it comes we talk about is there any synchronicity and here's a message i know take it with a grain of salt but can you see the star on top of the star okay and the star is a beauty guys it's like you clear your head okay you reach the best decision you clear your head and i'm going to talk about the star even more because i'm so 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 into the star today okay i'll tell you why okay not to waste time but we've got aces we've got tens we've got development we've got you going here after you know what those few changes that you really really need to do and you need to have some time and you need to be away in a way almost secluded from distractions look I look at the star and here you're going to see the previous the Marseille star and here is our um, ancient Italian star and I actually thought about this today so maybe you notice my my voice is a little scratchy okay I've had been coping with a cold I'm better right but the star moment I had my star moment I needed no distractions okay um, what was it Friday night and I did nothing and I did nothing sometimes that's what you need and the benefit of that sometimes is a ton of mental clarity okay so this message is coming up for you twice twice in the same position position number seven is when I ask the person I'm reading for is this really the subject is this really what we are trying to solve how do you see your action right now based on what you think is the question here we are looking at a choice okay let's get it back from the beginning here we are looking at a choice you have to make the lover there has to choose between two okay so maybe someone is being let go maybe something is being parted with that someone is being let go could be your packaging supplier right doesn't always have to be a co-worker and we are you know what not feeling good about it but really the moment you make up your mind you are super excited here with a queen of wands and uh, you know what change the devil that you are trying to break away from free yourself from free your business process from is the idea that you can make changes that idea okay is an ace is your possibility you are going to reach that idea you're going to get to those changes okay now the decision making is happening with the sword element here with rationality considering the future considering long term with a page of swords i love it i love it now prior you had an asset of being very 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 sharp right with an ace of swords it was and here we have the sun here we have you clearly clearly explaining to others why it is that we are doing what we are doing okay and your opportunity is almost ripe it's as if again we can say that that with a few tweaks you open the gate 
for a new stream of revenue here with the 10 of coins, okay? Or do you open the floodgates also for better profitability? I see quite a number of swords. Sometimes it is figuring something ab out about your costing exercise. That could take your margin from whatever, 10%, 12% to maybe 25, maybe 30%, okay? And guess what happens when you do that? The cycle is flowing even better. You're able to grow even more and more. You're gaining more confidence, etc. So we're looking at you making some changes, right? And taking some time on your own to actually determine your commitment to actually taking these changes forward. They may be sometimes tough calls, but your result is going to be three aces, okay? And you've had the fourth one here. So your timing is act right now. The purpose, well, you had the um, ace of swords here as the asset. The purpose is you're succeeding. The purpose is you're not leaving money on the table. The purpose is you're not going to let an opportunity go without the possibility of you getting a promotion or getting noticed, okay? And then we have here a coin as well. So let's bring back this card just for fun, guys, okay? For those of you unemployed seeking a job, I'm going to pull a card. For those of you employed already seeking a promotion, I'm going to pull a card. And for those, um, you know what, business owners, let's also pull a card, okay? So job seekers card, let's see what we get. And this will be from a majors. And let's give you guys a note on that. A job seekers message here. The path is mysterious sometimes. We need clarity. But at the same time, guys, um, you can get out of your comfort zone. And if there's any inspiration, I may be able to give you with the moon card. If it is tough this month, give it a month's cycle. Okay, it's only a cycle. It's only a cycle. And this is one of the busiest of the year, right? That's when people haven't figured out things yet or figuring out things and enacting changes on the go. Alrighty, so that's for the job seeker. This month, let's plant our seeds, okay? Let's plant our seeds, absolutely. A management note, compromise here. We have the temperance card. So finding solutions, finding chemistries, obviously. Um, in a way, if you were the manager, Aries, what we were doing here in this spread prior is in a way finding that chemistry, okay? It's letting go of something, it's adding something, it's completing a plan, and the chemistry element here comes more than once, okay? And now for the business owner, Aries, and we have the Empress, okay? Continue to develop what is tried and true. Continue to be traditional, continue to find ways, okay, to grow, to create, on top of the existing, okay, uh, creativity and action that you are taking towards growth here it is guys the message is really the star moment okay you are seeing things clearer and you are committing to big action ahead of you two times we get the star card in the position of how you see the current situation so inspired you are and committed you are and there's definitely a moment of truth where you have seeing things for what they are there's no mask in that star moment there's absolute truth and from there you can actually build and shore up all of that energy taking us to a ten of coins well guys this was our reading i hope you guys liked it let me know what you thought okay take some rest when you need rest aries okay take some rest when you need rest because we've got big action ahead of us and a year that is promising three aces Alrighty, guys, let me know what you thought. And as always, you guys should know, we do love you madly. And bye for now, guys.